I'm so sorry. Did you want this? No, no, you can have it. I'm just browsing here. I looked at the title and I literally reached out as you did. And it was like synchronized touch or something. <laughs> here you go. I, I, I actually think it's the last one anyway. Yeah. You're welcome. Oh, oh, nothing, it's just a cover. Uh, I thought it was a book by poets from the city of Limerick. And it's actually a book of silly Irish limericks. <laughs> so you like limericks, do you? <laughs> I see you giggling at the cover already. <laughs> you see, I only saw the book from the side. And it's Sunday morning in this sleepy village and <sighs> so I'm a sleepy villager and silly, look like city in my jumbled up mind. <laughs> oh, I'm kind of embarrassed now. Okay, I'm over it. <laughs> uh, where are you from? I know you're not from around here. That accent and browsing through a bookstore on a slumberous Sunday morn tells me that you could be from shores afar. Am I right? Oh, really? Oh. My name is Gail, by the way. I'm pleased to meet you. <laughs> Saw you like in Ireland. Yeah? Did you get some good old hospitality here already? Have people been kind? Yeah, that's normally the way of it here. But not always in the cities. But shh, don't tell anyone I said that. <laughs> you know I used to write limericks just for fun. Mm -hmm, all the time. Good, uh, I don't know, I probably wrote like three good ones out of a thousand or something. <laughs> no, I'm only joking. I really don't know. <laughs> um, I can't remember them off the top of my head, but I could try whip one up. That's if my Irish brain is online right now. But it's still early. And I haven't had my coffee yet. I prefer coffee to tea. Don't tell anyone. I might get pitchforked out of the village. <laughs> okay. Um, let me try. A lady walked into a store. To find a book she'd adore. She reached out her hand. But so did a man. And it felt like. They had met before. <laughs> that was rusty, I have to admit. I need to limber up on my limericks. <laughs> Especially if I get to see her smile each time. <laughs> Another one? Oh my god. You put me under pressure now. This is like a battle rap with limericks with myself. <laughs> okay. An Irish lad named Gail met a beauty in the town of Kinsale. She asked him for rhymes. He searched through his mind, but all he could conjure was fail. Oh God, I'm sorry. <laughs> Tarbron <or. laughs> This must be the weirdest chat up lane story tingy whatever is ever. <laughs> Oh, oh no, I, I didn't mean chat up. I mean chatting. <sighs> okay. <Whew. laughs> Give me that book. I'll use it as a fan and cot. <laughs> but uh, I am kind of... I don't know. I feel like there's some kind of like... <sighs> what was that? That was my uh, my attraction effect. My attraction sound effect. 
It's like I've been sucked into something, like something mysterious. Am I being weird? <laughs> I'm usually not like this. <laughs> I'm usually normal. <laughs> but can you feel it? You can. That's it. I'm blaming your smile. Yeah, it's your smile. And your solo in those. <laughs> you see, there it is. Did you feel uncomfortable in that silence? No, not at all. I feel like, I feel like we've met before or something. Like I said in my limerick. <laughs> Wait, is this a past life thing, do you think? Maybe. Maybe, yeah. Maybe you were the princess and I was the stonemason and we both met at a fair because date naps weren't in vogue at the time. And then we fell madly in love and it was forbidden. So your arranged marriage was kind of rearranged and you left the monarchy. And then we opened up a bookstore. Writing and selling limericks. Makes perfect sense doesn't it? Yeah. That's what definitely happened. <laughs> it explains everything. That synchronized touch. Your love of limericks. That connection thing. <laughs> and you know. I think I remember our first kiss. Yeah, but it's faint. It's like the visual memory is kind of whispery. But I can still feel it. I'm feeling it now, even though we haven't kissed yet. Can I... Can I kiss you? For all time's sake, perhaps? Hmm? 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 Oh my god. That's the feeling. Did you feel it? What is that? Mm. Oh. How long are you staying? Really? Oh my. Would you like to meet up for dinner sometime? I mean, there's only like two restaurants here. <laughs> <laughs> but <laughs> I promise I'll have better limericks I'll be spitting bars for you if you say yes oh oh my god <laughs> may I have your number <laughs> oh oh <sighs> okay Thank you. <laughs> so I'll call you when I free. Later tonight? Oh. I'll see you then. <laughs> but before you go, one Sunday morning, a man arose and decided to go out searching for some prose. He looked for a book and couldn't believe his luck when he ended up kissing such a lovely rose. <laughs> I promise they're only going to get worse. <laughs> mm. Mm. So I'll see you tonight then. 
Okay. Bye. Oh my god. She is amazing.